Welcome to Cooler Yoga Hawthorne and Hampton. I'm Casey and I'm going to take you up into the studios and show you some of the processes we've put in place to give you the confidence to come in and practice at the studio. So the door will only be open 10 minutes before class starts. So until then, please wait patiently outside, socially distanced or in your car until the teacher is ready to let you in. It just gives our team the chance to make sure the studio is spotless and ready to go and to avoid crossover of yogis in between classes as well. When you do come in, you'll take your shoes off as normal, put it in the shoe rack and you'll see that we have some floor stickers on the way up the stairs, all the way up to reception. So please just wait patiently if you need to on these stickers as you come up the stairs to check in for class. Bookings are compulsory. So while we have restricted numbers, you will already book, be booked into your class. You'll bring your own mat with you because we're, we still have our mats and our props out of action at the moment. So we're hoping that that opens up sometime soon. So you wait on your floor stickers to come in. You will use the sanitizer. So everyone will be using hand sanitizer as you arrive. And we just need to make sure that your details in our system are up to date. So please let us know if we need to update your email address or your contact number when you sign in for class as well. Once you've signed in, you obviously put your stuff in the lockers as normal, and then you will start to make your way into the studio room. So the teacher will have the door ajar for you. So we have less people with hands on high traffic areas. So the door will be half open. You go in and you set your mat up next to one of our new mat markers. So I'll take you into the studio. And you'll see that we have some pretty white birds. So these are our new mat markers. So you'll set up your mat next to the mat marker and then wait for the teacher to start class. So when you do start your class, the teacher will be based on their own map. So they might teach from the front or the back of the room. They won't be doing any hands-on adjustments. And then at the end of class, they will take you out of Shavasana so that they will seal the class together. And you'll have the chance to clean your mat in the studio room rather than out here in reception, just so that we have less crowds uh, in together. So hopefully that gives you a bit more of an idea how things will run when we reopen our doors and we look forward to seeing you again soon. Thank you so much for your support and we'll see you at the studio. Namaste.